Hey guys, what is up? It's been a while, but we're back. And I'm going to show you how to get a Game Boy emulator running on your iPhone without a jailbreak. So, a lot of people over the last few months have upgraded past 6.1.2, which was when the last jailbreak evasion worked, and are stuck without one. Now, one of the coolest features, or a uh, feature that a lot of people like about having a jailbreak, is allowing to customize your device and install emulators. Now, I'm going to be showing you how to get a Game Boy Advanced one for your device right now. So, the first step you're going to have to do is go into Mobile Safari and then go to the link in the description or bit.ly slash GBA no jailbreak and then when you hit go you should uh, lead be led to this github page right here there'll be install app button once you tap that it'll go to this new website where you'll just follow the steps hit the next button install app via OTA click install and once it does that this little application will install on your device now it can take a few minutes for me uh, I've tried it once it went really quick and then the other time it took around five minutes but when that's done I'll be back so once this loading bar progresses a new app will pop up called GBA uh, for iOS and once it pops up you can hit uh, the app right there now it may prompt you uh, asking if you're sure you want to open it just say yes very simple and what you're going to do next to get the ROMs so it's legal to download any ROM if you own the physical copy so what you're going to do is hit the search button on the top now it says it will open Safari so once you hit the open Safari it will lead you to a Google search cool ROM is the first result it's a great website and I highly re recommend it for use on your mobile device. So now you're going to need to pick a ROM to download. So for instance, I'll be getting Fire Red. I used to play this game back when I had a Game Boy Advance and it's pretty fun. And just hit the download button now. So this can take a little while depending on your connection, uh, especially because some ROMs are 10 to 20 megabytes. But you can see right here, once it does download, the device on is jailbroken, so it might appear a little different, but you should have somewhere uh, open in the emulator button. So once you tap that right there, you can see you have the ROM installed on your device. So if we tap it right here, it will open up and you can play it like you were playing on a Game Boy. Now there are more settings and stuff you can use to customize it, but I just made this video uh, to show you the basics. Thanks for watching. As always, you'll have the icon in your home screen if you want to go back to it. And I'll see you guys later.